Hello, I'm O.S. Hawkins. Have a question for you. What can you buy today for one dollar or less? A package of gum? No. A Coke or a soft drink? No. But I'll tell you what you can buy. A 64-page devotional, a Christmas devotional called The Christmas Code to use as an evangelistic tool in your church. You know, as a pastor, one of the great challenges I had in my decades of pastoral ministry was keeping the Christmas message fresh. And that's why I've written The Christmas Code with its 25 devotions from December 1st to December 25th through the Advent season to help us pause and ponder the true message of Christmas. You know, it also has in the back of it a section on God's personal Christmas gift to you, actually the plan of salvation. Hundreds of churches are using the Christmas code in their evangelistic outreach this year. You know, I, my first pastorate was in Hobart, Oklahoma. And out there in the southwestern plains, we had 900 homes in our little community. If I had had this book then during Christmas, I would have challenged my people to take it. And for less than a dollar, I could have provided it to place on every home in our whole community with an invitation to our Christmas services. Can you imagine the eternal impact if every member of your church could take a Christmas code and put it on every home on their block during Christmas with an invitation in it to your own Christmas services? I hope you'll join the hundreds and hundreds of churches who are buying this in bulk to make it an incredible evangelistic tool. You know, during the Christmas time, hearts are softer than they are any other time of the year. And if people are going to go to church sometime, they'll go one time if they have an invitation from you. So I hope you'll join us all in using the Christmas code in your Christmas promotions this year. And remember, like all the code series, every dime of royalty from the Christmas code or the Believer's Code that's coming out this fall also goes to support Mission Dignity and our dear retired pastors and their widows living near the poverty level. So I hope you'll pray about seriously using the Christmas code in your own church promotions this Christmas to share the true message of Christmas with your whole community. God bless you and thank you.